people are sometimes asking me for a Malaysian parang, but uh, I actually never used one because Philippines is Bolo country. But I became curious about it, so I decided to, to test one, this one here. And I have to say I'm not really impressed about it. One of the one of the reasons is that that curved shape of the of the blade is actually a little bit of a disadvantage in the tip area. When you try to, to strike a small branch or vine that is hanging in front of you, it might it might just slip away without getting really cut. And the second reason is because of the handle here. The shape is actually just curved. It is better if it is like an S shape. And after some research I realized that, uh, that this style, this shape of parang is actually more like the Bear Grylls parang. And if you try to have a closer look for the one that Ray Muse is using, you will notice that it is different. Ray Mears Parang got almost a straight blade and the blade and the handle is like an S shape. And that will be a lot more effective because if you have a look at this, uh, at this stick, my natural movement is in this area. If I have a branch here right in front of me, it is actually an advantage if the blade is bent down a little bit. So the natural movement is here. If you bend it in the opposite direction, like a parang, you have actually problems to hit that branch. A much better shape of a parang would be with a straight edge. And an S-shaped handle. Basically like this. This particular one here is a bit heavy. I mean it is good for processing firewood and stuff like this. But if you go into the jungle with it, it's too heavy. You probably want something that is a lot more lightweight and longer. What I really like about the parang is actually this area here in front of the handle. This area is not sharpened, it's not even close to an edge. I know that style of the, of the Filipinos, that they don't sharpen this area of the, of the machete, so you can choke up on it and do some carvings. But actually, the bolos still have an edge here, it's just not sharpened. This is a lot better with the parang, there is no edge at all. So, YouTube, please check out my 